everyone. Good morning, everyone. Hope everyone's doing well. Welcome to this beautiful summer's day. We are outside one of uh, my favorite new listings, if not the favorite new listing this month on 155 Alexandra Boulevard. So to give you a little bit of backstory on this, in Lytton Park, there are two streets which really are the sought after blocks and streets of Lytton Park. There's Alexandra and there's Lytton Boulevard. This is the best of the best in this area. It is east of Avenue Road. It's about a uh, one, one and a half block jaunt from Young Street. It's on a south facing lawn if you wanna have a look at the house. It is a 50 by 135 foot lot. This house has been beautifully kept up. It does have a full renovation as well. We're gonna walk inside right now. It has a two story addition on the back. The way the heating works is actually the, the front of the house is radiant heat. Uh, excuse me, uh, RADS, and then the back of the house is functioning by radiant heat. It has a two-story addition on it, so that means you're going to see there's a, ma a very large master uh, bedroom, bathroom, walkout terrace. There's a gorgeous open concept kitchen. This house has been lovingly cared for, for by a family for uh, the last uh, 10 years since we since we last purchased it. And again, location, you cannot do better in the city. So I'm going to put my mask on, and we're going to go take a look through the house. Okay, come on through. I also didn't mention to you, it's on a south facing lot, so 50 by 135 on south facing, which means you also get the sun all day long, okay? As you can see, it's a gorgeous red brick Georgian home. All right, I'm gonna have to mask up for this because people do live in this house. So we have to do COVID, COVID careful. All right, anyway, come on through with me. So as you see when you walk in, we have hardwood, uh, oak hardwood throughout all the upper floors in this home. Okay, we have very large principal dining room. Very nice, with living rooms as well. All these floors have been also reclaimed, so they're in really good condition. We have a fireplace in the living room as well. The stairs upstairs have also been redone with walnut flooring. And when you come through here, you will see we have beautifully all open concept. We have a side door entrance for families, which is a really nice touch. So really great for kids with a boot room. This is a great little extra off the side driveway, double door closet, really nice space for kids or families wanting to come in during the winter months, powder room, and then really great open concept kitchen with granite countertops, limestone backsplash, we have paneled, paneled appliances. So as you can see, it's really great space. What I like about this as well, is we have an open concept breakfast area just off the kitchen. As you can see, we have a gas fireplace insert as well, and really great size family room also, all open concept. So again, even though it's, a, it's an original older home, uh, this has been perfectly appointed just like all of our modern new builds as well. And the piece de resistance, come out look out here. We walk out for two double doors into an absolutely stunning backyard. I love this backyard. This was actually redone by Walters Landscaping a number of years ago. So if you have a look back here, you'll see we have a two-tiered deck and it walks out to Flagstone uh, below. We also have a really, really adorable uh, coach house which is great for storage. Uh, we've also had some clients who've already walked through the home in the last day. We just posted this yesterday on the MLS and have had a lot of people through already. This is a great space as well for people who might wanna have an art studio or maybe a kid, kid's hangout, or I was gonna say maybe it's a, maybe it's a good timeout room for a, uh, <laughs> for a spouse or a child if they're, if they're misbehaving. Anyway, it's a great extra space. It can also be insulated if someone wants it to use it in the winter as well. Okay, and as you'll see up here, we're gonna have a look up there in a moment, but we also have a really nice walkout terrace from the master bedroom. So in the summer months, you can also sit out there and read a book or, uh, or just hang out on the summer evenings, okay? So as you can see, this has been meticulously landscaped outside and we're gonna, we're gonna head back in and then head upstairs.
Little things I failed to mention as well so far, school districts for this area is also very important. So for people who want to have public school, you have access to John Ross Robertson Public School. You also have access to Lawrence Park Collegiate. And obviously for private schools, you are literally one block away from either Havergal or St. Clements. And for boys, you're a five minute drive from UCC. All right, we're gonna go upstairs. Okay, come on in. As you can see, we've got this awesome addition on the back of the house. Very high ceiling, so it's over 10 feet in this room. We have a wood burning gas, uh, sorry, not wood burning gas, we have a wood burning fireplace here in the master. And as I mentioned to you a moment ago when we were outside, very sexy. This, sorry for the noise, there's some gardeners next door. But this walks out to a huge terrace as well. I'll actually take you outside and show you. So, very cool here. Awesome spot for reading, chilling out in the evenings. And as you can see, it's just a gorgeous vista here, looking out onto the backyard. All right, we're gonna take you back inside. And the master as well is in great shape. It's very large. So have a look here. We have, again, with natural light, even if I turn these lights off, whoops. You can see I don't even need the lights on in this bathroom because we have a skylight also integrated into the bathroom. We have limestone floors. Um, again, uh, a limestone, um, actually it's marble, countertops, um, and everything's already been done stone-wise. Lots of extra cabinetry in this room. Oh, you can see me in the reflection. All right, we have a soaker jets tub as well and a standing shower, okay? And then again, with a lot of these houses, when you're on these premium lots, these 50 foot properties, um, they all have four, four bedrooms, which is great. So on this one as well, we have four principal size bedrooms, which are all really good sizes. Nothing too fancy up here with the bedrooms, but again, very functional for families. We also have a washroom that shares for all the bedrooms. So we have three additional bedrooms. One, then we have a secondary bedroom here. Two, what I also love about this, if you'll notice, I came in here before we started our video to turn on lights and look right above me. It's funny, my wife and I used to live in a house that was similar to this and we didn't have this skylight. I can't tell you how lovely this is coming in here to have this natural light that's, 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 that's bleeding down from the, from the roof line. So again, you're getting all this great natural light coming through the house. Again, this is a, the third bedroom. And then we have sort of a kids or family washroom to share. And that's here. And then we have a very large fourth bedroom as well. And this again has all been updated. As you can see, it's got tile flooring, single vanity. And then really great size fourth, uh, great size fourth bedroom as well. And the air conditioning system in this house is also called Space Pack, which means that the air conditioning system blows from the attic down, so the home does have central air as well. So again, in the summer months, it's actually a great system because it blows down and keeps the house all very cool, as opposed to some other houses actually blow from the basement up. So actually, I find this to be a lot more uh, effective for the summer months when it gets really hot. We'll just, we'll end up we'll just going back outside for a second. Anyway, thank you guys so much for round one. Uh, just to be clear on this house, we are not holding back offers. With a lot of homes in this neighborhood, there's so much demand that people hold back offers. In other words, they price it for an auction. We've decided uh, with, with COVID measures in place just to price this appropriately and put it to market. So first come, first serve. This has been crazy busy so far. 
I don't imagine it's gonna be around for long at all. And uh, it really is a unique home. I can't say enough. We're actually, my wife and I joke because we're actually a little bit upset with the vendors because last year we wanted to buy this house ourselves, but the timing wasn't right. So anyway, long story short, it's a great home. And uh, we'll see you at the next property. See you soon. And DM me if you have any questions about this, okay? We're happy to show it anytime.